Oh, the little lady preacher from the limestone church. I'll never forget her, I guess. She preached each Sunday morning on the local radio with a big black Bible and the snow white dress. She was 19 years of age and was developed to a fault, but I will admit she knew the Bible well. A little white lace hanky marked the text that she would use. She'd breathe into that microphone and send us all to hell. She had a guitar picker by the name of Luther Short, a hairy leg that so lost down in sin. She would turn and smile at Luther when the program would commence. With a voice as sweet as angels, she would break out in a hymn. I was picking for her too, with what we call the doghouse bass. I'd come to every word the pastor lives. She was down on booze and cigarettes and high on days to come. And she punctuated the prophecies with movements of her hips. The Lord knows how I loved her. He was there each time she preached. But old Luther took her home each Sunday morning. Looking back, I recall the way it hurt my tender pride. I longed to be a hero, but they're made not born. Sometimes old Luther showed up at the studio half tight, and smoking was a thing he liked to do. She never said a word to him, but said a prayer for me. I told her that in a way I had been praying for her too. One Sunday her old man showed up and said that she was gone. Said she and Brother Luther had a call. I can see me standing in the studio that day. I had to face the heartbreak, unemployment and all. I don't know where they are, cause I ain't seen them people since. If I judge them, let me give them lots of room. I know old Luther Short, and he's a hard old boy to change. And I often sit and wonder who it was converted home.